Hezbollah-backed fighters are taking an ever more active role in the ongoing Syrian conflict along the border with Lebanon. They claim their mission is to protect Shiites on the Syrian side who say their homes, villages and families have come under attack from Sunni rebels. Hezbollah chief Sheikh Hassan Nasrallah, leader of many of Lebanon's Shiites and a staunch ally of Syrian President Bashar al-Assad, has said his group is supporting the squads of fighters who call themselves popular committees. It is confirmation that the powerful Lebanese militant group is playing a growing role in the Syrian civil war just across the border. Syria's regime is dominated by minority Alawites, an offshoot of Shiite Islam, while the rebels fighting to overthrow Assad are mostly from the Sunni majority. On Saturday, the Associated Press was granted access to one of the popular committee fighting units on the edge of the border village of al Qusair. Camouflaged masked men holding Kalashnikov rifles could be seen patrolling a dusty olive grove on the porous border. We were in Syria for the first seven months of the crisis where we suffered a lot from the rebel roadblocks and the intimidation and killing of people by the rebels. As an example, three of our neighbors were kidnapped and killed. One of our neighbors was only 20 to 30 meters away from our house. Some of them were executed by shooting, others were slaughtered. It was very dangerous. Even though Hezbollah confirms backing the fighters, it denies it is taking part in the wider civil war. Syrian rebels offer a different narrative, accusing Hezbollah of propping up the Assad regime. As a result of the tensions, hundreds of Lebanese Shiite families in Syria have fled back to their homeland. Villager Bilal al-Sadr lived in Syria for 14 years before deciding to flee with his wife, four sons and a daughter. He said that he left after three of his friends, a Sunni, a Shiite and a Christian, were kidnapped and killed. Iran remains Hezbollah's most important patron, but Syria is a crucial supply route without which Hezbollah will struggle to secure the weapons it needs to fight Israel.